Moments after the gas explosion, local resident Walter McCaffrey started shooting his own video of the flames, and he joins us as well from San Bruno. Good morning, sir. Morning, Aaron. Tell, talk to me about what did you hear, what did you feel when this explosion happened? I was downstairs uh, in my bedroom and I was getting ready to uh, go to my mother-in-law's for dinner and uh, I just heard this, uh, it sounded like an aircraft taking off and just the blast after that and uh, it knocked me to the floor and I started running up to make sure uh, my wife and kids were out. They, they had already left maybe 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes earlier so I was just running around the house just to make sure they were out of the house. and. Uh, I started uh, calling 911. I couldn't get through, and uh, I just was trying to get a hold of my wife to make sure she doesn't come back for me. Right. And uh, that's when I saw. That's when I ran out and I started uh, taking video of uh, the big fireball. Could you feel the heat from the flames? I mean, this is just right outside your house, right? Right. Right. Uh, it, wasn't even a minute, and I couldn't even open my sliding door anymore to get out to the deck. Because it was, it so, was so hot. hot. And, wow. uh, it was so hot. And mm -hmm. I couldn't get out because there's a couple of ways to get out to my deck. And I couldn't get out to, to the, the, the deck because of everything was just so hot. Right. Did you think you and were... And when I finally got out... Right. Were you trapped in your house? Or, or where did, where, how did you finally escape? No, I, I wasn't. I actually ran out and I checked on my neighbors. And I ran back in to get my, my dog and that's when I had access out to the deck and mm. I, I, that's when I started videotaping and you could probably hear me yelling for my dog in, 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 on the footage. Yeah. Did you get your dog? Yes. Oh, good. I, I got him out uh, and uh, fire crews were already out there maybe in five minutes and uh, uh. they're already uh, telling us to uh, report to Lunardi's. Yeah. Let me ask you this. Did you ever smell gas in the neighborhood and did you ever give a second's thought to the fact that there might be a natural gas pipeline right, literally, running right underneath your neighborhood? No. I, I never smelled gas. And uh, I just thought it really, my initial thought was it was a plane crash. Wow. And I was y even yelling down at my neighbors mm. and asking them, was that a plane crash? Uh, it's, it's when I got to my mother-in-law's uh, I saw news reports that, you know, it could be a gas line right. that blew up, so. Wow. You have a, a, sto a good story to tell in that uh, you're able to actually move back into your house. Glad everybody in your household is uh, safe and sound. And Walter McCaffrey, thank you very much for taking the time to speak with us this morning. We do appreciate it, sir. Thank you, Harry. All right, be well. Thank you. All right.